Ah, Pine Valley Park. For those of you who live in the Pioneer Road and Grinnett's Fork neighborhood, you know all about this gem. Much loved by the children who grew up here, Pine Valley Park has aged to the point where it needed an upgrade, and wow, did it get one. Come take a tour with us in this week's episode of City 101. If you don't live in the Pioneer Road area, this park is easy to miss. It's a true community park, nestled in the backyards of houses. You can't drive directly up to it, but there are three entryways into the park. One located off of Grenance Fork, one off of Grenance Lane, and the other one off of Burton Fork. There aren't any parking lots, you just park on the side of the road and take the short path in. Pine Valley's unobtrusiveness has kept it something of a neighborhood secret, but its recent upgrade has made it a destination for families and kids citywide. In early spring, Public Works staff held an open meeting in the park and welcomed the public to view playground plans from five different companies and give feedback as to which one they would like to have installed. It was an excellent example of community engagement and work commenced on the park. The newly renovated park includes entirely new playground equipment, including a 2-5 to five year old play feature, a 5-12 to 12 year old play structure, new swing sets, a spring rider, a matrix 12-foot climbing net, and the biggest hit with the kids so far, a 100-foot zip line. As fantastic as these improvements are, we're not done yet. Public work staff will be installing a new basketball court, benches, light poles, new bases, and a pitching mound for the baseball field. The final steps will be new grass and dirt work, which Public Works hopes to have completed in October. So put the kids in the car and come on down. The park is open, and it's awesome. That's the scoop on Pine Valley Park. Got a question you'd like answered by those in the know? Send it to the city through our Facebook page, website, or call it in. It just might be the story behind the next installment of City 101.